Hi everyone, in this video we're going to show you how you can use the Transport in order to translate your web page. And uh, you're going to have to upload the Transport straight from the WordPress.org and you can use just the WordPress and I'll show you the link. So this is the one where you're going to have to upload the plugin and I have already installed it um, on my WordPress backend. So it appears right here. So you just click on the transpose and um, it's going to show you the settings for it. And you go into languages and choose the language that you want to use for your web page. So currently I have Deutsch, I have Romanian, Russian and um, Spanish and you can choose either one that you want. Let's click on the Portuguese and take this one off and just click on save changes. So it's pretty simple as far as choose which language you want to use and um, after the page has been updated don't forget to go into appearance click on widgets and um, add your transport to the main slide bar and so simply you just take it and drag it. So let's just do it and uh, you'll see how it's done. So you access the transport, and you take it and just click drag it. Click on save so it's saved to your um, web page. So let's just visit our, our page and see what it looks like. And uh, here's the web page. And uh, let's just refresh. The widget appears right here. So it says translation. And currently we use the English language. And we can choose any language that we want. So let's take the Russian language and it will um, refresh automatically and you can click on the, um, this bar in order to correct the words that you want to correct and uh, you can choose the Portuguese and do the same thing so you can uh, edit the words so when you edit the words you simply click here and it will give you the English version as well as the uh, Portuguese, so the language that you have chosen, and you can add it. So it says Comatal, but let's just say it's not right and say it's Kamatal. Might be so, it <laughs> might be not. So just click on yes, and uh, it will save you the option. So here's the change that we have made, and it's turned into green. You can click on the next one, and instead of share, it's <laughs> let's just edit it like this like it more. So we can go on next, Facebook, we'll still remain Facebook, but we'll want a capital letter. So click on the capital letter and click on yes, you want this change to be saved or you can go back and just add it uh, to the way it was. So it's C O M O T A L means. Click on save and you see that you will change automatically. So it's pretty easy. Um, you can edit the entire page and you can edit any uh, tab that you want. Just click on the uh, orange bar and you can add from admin administrator to admin. And click it to save it. So it's pretty good and easy uh, plugin and we do recommend you use it in case if you need it. And um, you can go from language to language anytime and just switch between them. And you can add um, as far as five languages to the web to the web page, um, and you can edit either one of them. Hope you enjoyed the video, and thank you for watching.